Oh, man. We haven't had a good uh, earthquake in a while. No, we haven't. We had two the first year that we were living here. I'm not going to knock on wood because I want a You want earthquake. an earthquake. All right. You're pro-earthquake? Yeah, I think, you know, it's up to the earth. The earth wants to quake, man. You're pro-choice. That's right. For earthquakes. Yeah, I'm not uh, earthist. Yeah. Being earthist, that that's bad? Bad? Good? I don't know. Look, dude, look, it's not, like, so I am not earth. Yeah. So who am I to, like, decide what earth wants to do with its body? It's not a, that's not up to me. If the earth wants to quake, I've got nothing that, that's not me, dude. You're right. That's, uh, that's, that's mother earth's decision. That's, yeah. that's her, mother. her body, her choice. Her body, her choice. Yep. If, if, if she wants to fucking raise her ocean levels and flood a small town in Haiti. Yeah. That's not. Honestly, you're misogynistic if, if, if you think there's a problem with that. That's right. It's yeah. not, cause that's, that's up to mother earth. Yeah. That's her not choice. Me. If she wants to erupt a giant volcano Ugh. that covers a small stick village in in mountains of ash yeah that's her choice that's that's not me i wouldn't even begin to imply that uh that i would even have a sway in in yeah. her decision yeah all i can say is that i am here to support exactly i'm here to yes. support whatever decision mother earth makes that's right yep that's right. Look, if she wants to tsunami a coastal village of a million people, that's fine. That's good. It's it's not it's not up to me. It's up to me to be there to support her. It's all about support. Yeah. You have to support Mother Earth. Mother Earth. Exactly. You have to. Mm -hmm. And look, if she wants to, if she wants to turn up the AC a little bit over five hundred years, yeah. I don't think that's up to me. Nope. No, nope. I'll do what I can, yeah. but it's not like uh, it's not like I said. It's it's all I'm. A, I'm I know. I know. I know. This is super stressful. I know that that yeah. you're, you've been stressing out about this. But yeah, yeah. It's, I mean, you and I we were talking off the pot yeah, about this. Yeah. So we, also, we, I mean, we do it a lot. So uh, yeah, I just don't want to get fucking heated on the podcast. look. Look, if if Mother Earth wants to cover most of Florida in water, yes, Florida is her body. So be it. That's her choice. It's her choice. So, so be it. It's up to her. Honestly, it's ignorant to try to to try to intervene. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. People are all like, "All oh, the ice caps are melting." You know, you see every day. Every day, you'll see these videos of like a glacier collapse. Yeah. yeah. She's doing her thing, man. Mm -hmm. I think Mother Earth knows what she's doing. Hey, okay. Okay. Look, she she's been here for like a four billion years. Yeah. I think she knows what she's doing. Yeah. All right. Her body, her choice. Look, if she wants to melt Antarctica, that's fine. It's fine by me. Yeah. Look, if she wants to light California on fire every single summer until we're all dead, that's up to her. I got nothing to do with her decisions. It's misogynistic for me to have a say in what Mother Earth wants to do. Yes. yes. And honestly... and that's, it, very, that's very adult of you. Yeah. Th hey... Thank you. Thank you. For, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I, l I love this for you. <laughs> that might have been the... Fucking... <laughs> that might have been the derailment right there. <laughs> oh, no, that was, that was... You ever heard fucking people say that? <laughs> yeah, dude. I love this for you. I love this for you. I actually... I love oh, this for you. Oh, man. Whatever, dude. Oh, that's so funny. If if Earth is a mother, what's the what's the father space? If Earth the sun, the sun maybe no. If, <laughs> what's the father? Earth is a mother. What's the father? The father is is the moon because he hangs out on the artillery like like in, in, at at the edge of things while she makes all the calls and he just kind of like hangs out. Yeah. The moon is like a divorced uh, uh, dad that kind of just like watches over like oh, yeah yeah. You know, I wish that's a shitty dad though. I mean that's a <laughs> shitty dad. The moon. Yeah. If the no, moon no, if the th if the moon is the the father that's a that's a that's a not a good no not a good father. I think Earth, Earth is the mother. That's fine. I'm fine with that. Or is it? But the, I think everything else yeah. is father. <laughs> I think yeah, it goes because the Earth, the Earth is like beautiful. 
It's amazing. Yeah. It's perfect in every way. Um, but it's also but a- it only exists because of everything else, <laughs> which is Father Space. <laughs> Father Space. <laughs> Father Galaxy. Honestly, the Earth the Earth is kind of like a shitty girlfriend, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? Cuz you're all like a like 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 everything gives it everything that it wants, you know, and it's it's here, it's this it's the perfect place. I would never <laughs> fuck around on Earth, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like if if I found Earth, I'd marry it. Yeah, no, it's perfect. You imagine dating like Venus and then like Pluto, you're bouncing uh, around and then you get you get to Earth. Yeah. You're like I'm marrying this lady, dude. That's such a great point. And yeah, and and then, that's so smart. Yeah, and, then, and not stupid. And then she, and then she's like, a hurricane. You're like, ah, yeah. dude, dude. It's like, I mean, imagine going up to Saturn and being like, yeah, you're big. You got that sick fucking ring. Mm-hmm. That's tight. But uh, you know, you're just a bunch of gas. And then you find Earth. Yeah sexy as fuck yeah all this land fucking blue yeah bird animals yeah Yeah, birds going with those hot fucking white clouds dog yeah dude atmosphere yeah you can support life Mm -hmm. not like fucking other of the fucking eight planets i don't even know how many planets there are earth might be the only chick planet in because because only life happens here you know yeah you know who's a dude who's that pluto yeah. Yeah, because he just he just he kind of just hangs out by. He just wants to be left alone. You know, yeah. he's sitting out there. We always try to get out and take pictures of him. He's like, nah, stop, yeah. stop. He just wants to be left alone, dude. He just Pl- wants to spin, dog. I think Pluto is a dude, but he's like a douchebag. <laughs> he's kind of an asshole. That's yeah. why he got fucking kicked out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why he got kicked out, dude. Solid guy, Mars. Mars is tight. Yeah, Mars, yeah. Mars, 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 like goes to the gym. Yeah. You know, he he can he can put up like two twenty five. You know. Yeah. Mars is a solid guy. Yeah, that's why we keep him. That's why Earth keeps him close. Yeah, yeah, he keeps Earth like, keeps Mars around. Yeah, like right there. Yeah, like right there, just in case, just in case. Uh, Earth keeps Venus close too. Yeah, but Venus, Venus is like a toxic X, full of gas. You know, everything you send there melts. You're so right. Yeah, toxic X. To- that- Venus is the toxic X. Uh, <laughs> not even to mention, it sounds like penis. Which is a big, oh yeah no you're right big red flag yeah big red flag you can't date a chick planet named penis no no, no that's dumb it's like one letter away dude. yeah dude I'm too close Mercury nah Mercury's like that fucking now Mercury's flirting with the sun too much he's too close he's too close yeah the sun's definitely a guy and Mer- the sun is a guy the, the sun is a guy the sun is a guy there's but, no question but but also weirdly there's immediately no question yeah, about yeah, that. yeah but but also that makes mercury gay for hanging out so close to him you know that the sun and mercury are like like low-key gay but they don't tell the rest of the planet <laughs> yeah did they yeah yeah but that is pretty gay why are you so yeah. close to the well, sun yeah, yeah come on why are you that close dude why are you so close because yeah. obviously it's so clear that the perfect location yeah is it's where earth, earth, is. earth is yeah so it's like, why are you, why, why be any other length away? Look, I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna give Mercury some time to come out of the closet. Um, I don't think I don't know if if Sun is ready to to come out of the closet, but uh, dude, they're they're definitely planet planet fucking each other. They they probably are. Probably. Jupiter. Oh, Jupiter's gay as hell. You think so? Yeah. Jupiter? Yeah. You know I many, don't get a gay vibe from Jupiter. I get a I get a gay vibe from Jupiter because you know how many moons it has? It's got like the most moons. It keeps the most other planets around. He's like a gigolo, you know? I think actually, I think Jupiter's kind of like a player, though. No, 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 yeah, no, 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 yeah. no, 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 no. I think Jupiter's got those, keeps those fucking moons close, man. It. He might. I, I'm getting like player vibe from Jupiter. Actually, that's a good point. If anyone's gay, here's the thing. I didn't realize. I didn't even think about the moons until you said the moons. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so so Jupiter is a player. He keeps some 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 of those chicks just orbiting around. You know. Yeah. You know who's gay? Who's that? Saturn. With the ring. The bling. Too, oh, the too, co- the too, cock ring. Too flashy. Yeah. Too flashy. Yep. Saturn's cock mm-hmm. ring, dude. That's gay, dude. And that big red spot. What little. Big fucking red fucking spot on oh, Saturn. That's Jupiter. Oh, is that Jupiter? No, I think that's Saturn. What? If, no, that's that's for sure Jupiter. Jupiter's blue. What if Saturn's red? That's Neptune. Then there's Pluto. <laughs> I forget the planets. You know who Uranus is? Weirdly, 
He's like a he's like the nerd of the solar system. He is because he spins on his side. He does. He goes actually. Mm -hmm. uh, nobody likes that guy. Yeah, and it sounds like your anus. Yeah, yeah. Hilarious for all time, by the way. <laughs> Hilarious for all of existence. <laughs> Until there's no people in this fucking solar system, yeah. your anus is funny forever. I'm surprised they haven't changed that. Yeah. Because, like, every eighth grade science book, when they were like, this is the next planet, yeah. weren't you like... <laughs> yeah. Every, <laughs> your anus, and everyone goes... <laughs> <laughs> but like, but. Yeah, dude. That's funny forever. Yeah, man. Find me the most unfunny person on, on this planet, your anus... Would probably make him laugh, dude. The guy that the guy that discovered Uranus, that was like the first joke he made. He was like, "Hey, hey, yeah. e e fucking Euclipides or whatever. Yeah, check out, check it out. It's Uranus. What should we name it? I don't know. Maybe how about your anus? Ha 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 ha. That won't stick. <laughs> <laughs> that won't stick for all of eternity. <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, Mother Earth, Earth gets mother. That's fine. Yeah, but space." It's father, father, space, eternity. There's something there. There's something there. <laughs>